Well, you guessed it, folks. I come down here today. Even though the Saskatoons are probably done, there's no more berries. It's 115 degrees in the sun, 105 in the shade today. I got a fishing rod with me, and I got my gold pan and shovel with me. We're going to do some panning, and maybe get a fish. That'd be nice. Fresh trout for dinner. Nom nom. The grasshoppers, we have a huge infestation of grasshoppers this year. Salsify is still growing. Napweed's horrible. I wanted to do this spot down here that I had in my previous video when I was down here getting the Saskatoon berries which yes they're all done I don't want to go down here this napweed is so hard on the legs scrape you up that in the sagebrush this is what this is this sagebrush it gets huge here turns into tumbleweeds all right <laughs> get through the jungle down into here this is where I want to be no remember high water was up here that's where high water was and I wanted to pan out this spot here maybe that looked real good Maybe some of that. Water levels are dropping. So I will have to be careful. But I'm in the shade down here. And there's a bit of a breeze. It's a lot nicer. Okay. No doubt I could probably do my panning right in here. Like that idea. He's flowing fast still. Oh, isn't that water look inviting? But not with that current. We swept away in no time. We'll get my feet wet, but I ain't getting the rest of me wet. All right, I'm getting on it. Well, there's my first test hole for this area here, which is where I said I wanted to try when I come in here. I'm not walking down through that stuff right now. So that hole yielded zero. Then I came down here, figuring the flow was going this way. So and we did find gold here once before can't remember the exact shovel where we stuck it in but oh well so I did this one next and it yielded zero very little black sand so then I went over here to where my shovel is and I did a, this hole found more black sand but still zero gold so I'm going to try one or two more pans if I don't get anything in five pans, well, I ain't working for nothing, so then it's fishing time.
How'd you like that wrap that went by? That was pretty cool, hey? Yeah, I was hoping I could have got a better shot of that, but I wasn't on the ball with the camera. They went that way. Way up there. This is the desert, folks. This is the desert. Yeah, I'm a bit shaky after that digging. That's Castle Rock right there. So where's the best place to be when you're in the desert? You guessed it. Right here. Got a nice shady spot. Nice cool water to sit in. Get a little bit wet, but this current's dangerous, man. Well, that was the fourth hole for today. And you know what? I ain't gonna do a fifth hole. That's the second time I've been here to this spot. That's the trail out, it's underwater still. But we had very extreme high water this year. This is where high water should be. It was 10 feet higher than this. A week ago, I would not have been able to get into this cute little spot here. Oh, look who's going by. Yeah, it's the V rail. Yes, passenger trains are running. That's the wheel rail. That's way across the river. Anyway, I come down to this, this cute little spot here. At high water, it's a nice spot if you can get in here. There's a cool little pool for panning right there. Or soaking your feet. But I like it over here. Because over here... Yeah, I can walk in the water. Cool my feet off. That's where I did that pan. Worked that pan right there. Yeah, this is a nice spot to walk in the water. That water is deep. Like, I mean really deep. Really deep and fast moving. Just look at that. all the way down to well, that one rock right there and that's as far as I can go right now well that's as far as I'm going to go right now so yeah I'm just chilling out walking in the water enjoying the beauty on my feet best way to cool down is keep your feet in cold water that's what I always say so today, I got skunked. The water's still too high and flowing too fast for the fish. And this is the second time I've tried this spot. Found some nice black sand, but no gold. So, c'est la vie. Ah, uh, not even I can get gold every day. Good prospecting's like that. Well, I think it's time to head home, have a cold beer. Think about making something for dinner because I'm losing my shady spot here. So, and it being over 100 degrees today, 
yeah, I want to go and get inside where the cold beer is. So, I'll see you all next time. Keep your pans wet and your shovels dirty. The way out goes this way. <laughs> and I'm surrounded in butterflies. Look at all the butterflies. I don't know if you'll see that, but it's pretty cool.